Listen, I know it has a funny name, but you're just gonna have to bear with me. But we're talking about Gene Seed. Gene Seed is the stuff that takes a scrawny teenage boy and turns him into a nine foot tall super warrior. It's basically what makes a space marine a space marine. So during their creation, a space marine is implanted with 19 different organs each of which gives them a different superhuman ability. This includes things like a second heart, a third lung, a gland that literally lets him spit acid, and even the ability to heal from pretty much any injury. And all of these things require Gene Seed to be made. And unfortunately, there's not a lot of this stuff. See, it was originally created by the God Emperor of Mankind, and it was basically genetic material derived from the Emperor's 20 sons. They're demigod-level individuals known as the Primarchs. Since he was put into a coma 10,000 years ago, the ability to make new Gene Seed from scratch has been lost. Now, there is still one way to get new gene seed, and this is through arguably the most important implant a space marine receives. It's what is known as a progenoid gland. See, a space marine will actually be implanted with two of these things, and the entire time they're in a space marine's body, they're absorbing information about them and all of their implants, and that information can be used to turn recruits into brand new space marines. The first gland is located in the space marine's neck and can be harvested after about five years. The second is located in their chest, but that one takes about 10 years to mature and can unfortunately only be harvested after the space marine dies. And it's the sacred, albeit grim, task of the apothecaries to harvest these grands from their fallen brothers. So that genetic material can be used to make the implants of a new recruit. And at least in some way, this allows the fallen space marine to live on through new recruits. Needless to say, it's often impossible to recover their fallen brothers, meaning that Gene Seed is always in short supply.